What is going on you lot? Midi here. I've got to talk to you guys about probably one of the best stamina perks in the entire game. There's a lot of you that are getting caught out. You know, you're getting one-shotted by Leatherface. And I think a few of us are curious on certain perks in the game. I want to talk about Choose Flight, which is the endurance perk. Just stamina bar gets depleted, it's going to instantly refill and it has three charges. Head out with a character like Julie and you can obviously go in your skill tree, reduce her stamina consumption up to 100% if you get to level three. You just run forever. The map's big enough, you can just send the killers on a ghost chase. And I was able to capture probably one of my favorite gameplay where I'm just sitting in the bush, the generator's off, and it's a race between me, Hitchhiker, and Leatherface to the exit. It's so good. I was using Sneaky Pete and Highly Skilled in the video. If you really wanted to make the best stamina class, put a perk on like Conditioned, where when you run out of stamina, it's going to take up to 60% less time to start regenerating. Again, you can just combine them with a lot of endurance perks. You're going to be able to run forever. Put 10 points into my endurance, and then I've got 13 on my proficiency, just so it's set at 40. I think you guys were telling me that you only need to have your proficiency in stealth around about 40 for it to be high enough to do anything you want in the game while making zero noise then this is the skill tree to get the perks you have to go straight down the middle and you're going to get choose flight right there and there's some pretty decent other endurance perks along this tree but you guys have got to let me know what perks you'd like to use with choose flight as always make sure you guys leave a like on the video support the channel and let's try it out let's do it we'll also starting off with julie as well we can just look at that no noise let's see if they can actually catch me with this perk and only imagine how cursed it's going to be trying to see hitchhiker catch up with me with this with Sunny, which is good. Latch this for a sec. I'm trying to watch myself when I latch these doors here. I don't actually want to get people killed when I latch them. It's just to give me a little bit of time to actually get my lock picks without Leatherface charging in here. Even with this Julie build, she's not going to have a lot of toughness. So you still got to be a little bit careful if you do get caught out. So I've been experimenting with a lot of perks in the game. I'm trying to get a lot with level 3. I don't know who my main is at the minute. It's got to be Leland or Julie. Them two are just, I don't know. The most fun to play for me. I feel like the killers just always play so well on this map. Barely got any move space. When you've got someone like Cook and Hitchhiker on this map, pain. Very painful. we do this. The reason why Julie's amazing. Can't go for the grandpa stab. I've got my double lock picks. Matches for a sec. See, this door right here is actually quite good. It's kind of the spot that Cook or Hitchhikers, they're a little bit less... Oh, wait! Like, I don't... Wait. <laughs> I don't even want to make the noise with a lockpick. That's what I'm worried about. That's the first one done. I think he's feeding him. This piano room door, a lot of the time killers don't put traps on it. Find a good time. You see what I mean? No, they're always using the front door, never the side. They can't ever tell when that lock's come off. This could be an easy win, though. If we just get the generator off, we're, we're home free. Oh, it's not here. Oh, no. Activated ability just to move ahead a little bit. Look, I'm, I'm confident that I can outrun him here. Your ability counter is Johnny's tracking. So I like to activate it, sort of sprint away, go into a bush that's a little bit further. He hasn't seen you. You're, you're good. You're good. I don't know if he got, like, bamboozled in the bush or what. Ooh, trap there, though. Okay. Always remember that when you got got hitchhiker on your game, man. Watch them traps. I've noticed that really good hitchhikers will put them in completely random spots. Or maybe sort of like looping areas. Some other hitchhikers put them on objectives. No way. No way. Help me do right, that. Okay. There is no way he just walked past me like that. The power of the camouflage. How many times have I got away with that stuff? Can we still there? Disable the trap. But that's going to be Hitchhiker's thing where he's going to look, he's going to see the trap's been untouched, and then he's like, cool, don't have to deal with this area anymore, and then that's when you've got to use it and just go. I think we're good. I, I can't believe he just walked past there. So if you don't know, the higher your strength is, the less time it takes to actually kick that off. Good. I can see Leatherface though. I'm hoping they don't see me here. 
hoping that not one of them checks that generator there. I might have time to get away. Oh, wait. I can see him. Wait. I mean, what are they doing? Do they know the generator's off? What, what is he doing? Why is he moving walking? Can he see me? Right, we've got the ability. I'm going to go for it. Wait, wait for it, wait for it. This is going to be a race. Before they turn the generator back on, man, I've got to go. Wait for Grandpa to go off. What are you doing? It's like they know where I am, but they're just... I don't know. I think they're just trolling. Right, I'm out. See that, boys? Activate ability. Let's go. Oh, the chase is on. Let's go, let's go. Oh, mate, they are catching up. <laughs> they're catching up. Come on. I'm going to bait it out. I'm going to bait this hit. Wait for it. Now. Whoa. We good. Look at that, boys. And we're out. What a beautiful example of that perk. Jesus. So they can catch up with you. They almost did. Let's go in another game. Game number two. Oh, and we got the ass again. The family house. It's just hard. I feel like if you've got a cook and a hitchhiker, man, I just... I don't know. My chances of winning always go down. It depends if people are getting knocked out early. As soon as you start losing a couple of victims, it's pain, man. But we've pretty much started in the same spot, so I'll take it. My double lock pick down. Look at that. Wait. Is he? Is he hiding his back because of a Leland or something? What's going on? Yeah, have you. So a lot of you guys are telling me, like, the game seems really confusing or difficult. I just think the maps are confusing. Once you understand the maps, the perks and everything else, you know, do that in your own time. Connie just survived the hit there. I need to open this now. Just in case she runs over. So this is one of my favourite basement exits to use on a house map. Just gives you a lot more space away from everything. A lot of the time the killers are just going to be rotating the house. At least he got a bit of a chance. Go. They do have a sissy though that I'm a little bit scared of. I won't lie. Hopefully. Doesn't actually check this back door and we're good. Another toolbox behind here. I think the toolbox spawns are also random. I don't know. The toolbox always seems to spawn here. I think it is actually random. There we go. We've got two now. Pretty much we can get through any door. Gonna probably do the piano door again. That little side bit. Gonna gamble it with the killers here and just hope they've not kind of trapped this bit out. They crouched here. This is the hardest bit. You can't try and get through here, wait. Okay, let's turn the uh, lamp off. Actually, no. Let's trap it. I'm yet to get the lamp stun on someone. It will happen, though. Good. Pick lock the door. God, man, it's tense. As soon as you're in that radius and it starts pinging yellow. I just, I just start rushing, look. We good, we good. Take it nice and easy. Oh. oh, we ain't good. Oh, man. I mean, at least I got the door open. We might have to go into well here and reset. There's a well up here. Sometimes the wells switch and it really puts me off. Are we good? Drag her all the way over here. Okay, we've used choose flight once. You've really got to level that perk up. Get to level 3 so you've got the free charges. I mean, she didn't even touch me there, which is massive. I'm going to take a bone knife this time. Now, give me my damn XP. See, now we've actually got a bone knife. Killing the chicken is on the cards. Jumping down the wells can be your reset. You can sort of come to the basement, heal back up again, you know, plan a little bit ahead. Try and get upstairs again. Oh, nope. sometimes I like to do that just to throw them off a little bit. All the time, good killers are just going to see you open that door and then straight away come down. Like this. Oh my god, we good, we good. What's this dude doing, bro? I swear this is like the second game we had a... 
I mean, I mean, okay. Just close the door in my face. Scan on. on. Sonny's just standing there. Alright, thanks, Sonny. You can take the aggro for me. You good. I do think that sometimes, like, I reckon he wouldn't have seen me if I stood still. Yeah, goodbye, Sonny. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I mean, where was going to run? Oh, no, and she's on me. Close door in her face. Oh! My God, that was close. you got to be very careful when closing the door in their face. If they hit you, it cancels the animation. We might be able to loop her here. Let's see. We've got a little bit of time to hide. I'm just going to stay so close to this bush, though. Oh, wait. Okay. I think the sissy and the leather face are on comms, too. Hitchhiker or not. I'm going to go back down here. It duped, my friends. We're going to do the biggest rotation ever. I'm going to go back down, try to hide, and then come out the same exit again. Right, the plan's simple. Hide, and then hope that they run past me, and then we're going to go back out that same exit. <laughs> oh my god. I swear to god, right, I get really lucky with this. Just sitting down and not moving. I don't know if they've got a really bad FOV. Like, uh, we get back out. I think we're good. I'm going to do it again. I'm going to go for generate. Ooh, generator's turned off. Okay. Someone's dying, though. This is the second game in a row where the hitchhiker's acting a little bit fruity. A little bit sus. First game, they're slow walking. Second, they're just standing around. I've definitely noticed recently, though, there's been a lot more DCs in the game. Not really sure what the deal is with that. Right. Only me left now, anyway. I have no idea what's going on. Everface is over here as well, but what is he doing? Hitchhiker's just standing around. What are you doing? Let's just do it. I mean, the generator's still turned off. Wait for the shout to go down and we're going to run. I'm just going to backstab him and sprint, man. I don't know what's going on. Hold this for me. <laughs> See you later, boys. And we're out. But this time, we ain't getting chased. I'll take it. I reckon even with one charge and using Julie's ability, you can run all the way past there. Shouldn't be able to get caught. Mm. Bit of a weird game. But we'll take it. And that was it with the Choose Fly perk. I really do think you guys should start using it. Super good. And it is a pain to go against victims that are using it. And let me know what you guys actually think about that perk. See you lot later.